Hi, I'm Mike Lawrence with AAG Golf Group and TGM Golf Academy here in upstate South Carolina. And today I want to talk about figuring golf grip sizes. Okay, we work with a lot of folks, uh, different body shapes, sizes, kids, young adults and adults. And the question often comes up when it, when it comes to talking about club fitting, what grip size is going to be best for an individual? Well, when we talk about grips, th there are in fact different sizes. There would be a junior size grip, there's a ladies size grip, and then there's an, a, a men's grip. And even within each of those three categories, there will be different sizes uh, of grips uh, for each category. For instance, with the, uh, with the men's grip, there's what would be considered a smaller men's grip, uh, and then a medium-sized men's grip, and then a larger grip. So when we, when we are helping folks with, uh, with their club fitting and, and determining good grip size, there's a, there's a good rule of thumb, no pun intended, but there's a good rule of thumb as to how to determine what size grip you need when it comes to uh, best fitting your hands. He, here's what we want to see when we're gripping a golf club. <clears throat> as you grip the club with your lead hand, you'll notice how my middle two fingers as I make the grip, they're just barely touching the thumb pad of my left hand there. If, for instance, I have a grip, and when I grip the club, these two fingers dig into that thumb pad right there, the grip's too small, and it's going to make our hand action much too flippy during the swing. Then on the other hand, if we have an individual who might have smaller hands, and, and when they grip the club, these, these two fingers uh, are not reaching that thumb pad. In other words, there's a sizable gap in there. Then that grip is too big, and it's going to make it difficult for that person, that golfer, to effectively use their hands as they need to in the golf swing. So when we're talking about grip sizes, it very much has to do, obviously, with the, with the size of the person's hands. But the rule of thumb that we want to go by is to try to get the middle two fingers of your left hand, if you're a right-handed player, right hand if you're a left handed player, get those middle two fingers when we grip the club to just gently touch the thumb pan of that lead hand. When we do this, the grip's going to be uh, the right size for us and get us on the right track in terms of uh, developing a good grip, which ultimately leads to a better golf swing. Once again, this is Mike Lawrence with AAG Golf Group and TGM Golf Academy here in upstate South Carolina, and today we talked about figuring golf grip sizes.